Hi everyone, it's Nikki here from Gummy Line Plans and uh, today I want to bring you a flip through of a beautiful journal slash planner that I bought um, from Lamika Design and Illustration based in Cape Town. Uh, the owner is a lady, um, stunning, stunning woman called Roseanne Marais and Roz is beautiful. She's just stunning. She's amazing to deal with and um, I highly recommend her services. Highly, highly, highly. She's a graphic designer, so she does all sorts of other things as well. But the planner is what we're here for. So it is an A5. It is 500 pages, over 500 pages. I'm just going to read right off the back here. It says, this planner is designed to be used as a journal or a diary or both. Enjoy over 500 pages, which include daily journaling and or daily notes and entries, important dates, things to do, goals and action plans, weekly planners, end of week check-ins, inspirational and faith quotes, and coloring in illustrations. And for more uh, products, visit lamikadesign.com. I will have her link down in the description box. Um, so yeah, let's have a look without further ado. So it's um, a cardstock cover. It's a laminated in a sort of matte satin finish, which is really nice actually i quite like it it feels great um it's on the wiro binding um and it is white pure white paper uh the paper itself the quality is very good i would say that it is 80 between 80 and 90 gsm um not being an expert um per se sorry i just need to have a little sip of my mm my juicy and you love it it's my bottle my water bottle i got from woolies for my anniversary love rose gold love water okay sorry about that um so you open up and the first page has got a dear so whoever you are page so you write your name in here and it says dear and so for me it would be dear nikki my wish for you is to enjoy every page as you write your thoughts jot down your daily tasks or simply color in to refresh your mind and take a breather I pray that God's grace will rest upon you and that this planner will awaken something deep and deep within yourself. Be kind to yourself, take care of yourself, but most importantly, love yourself. All my love, Roz. I think that's lovely. So we open straight up. And this is one of the examples of her hand-drawn illustrations. Um, I love it. It's beautiful. I personally am not a color inner. Um, I don't enjoy it. I thought I would because I'm a creative person, but it's not my thing. I don't have patience for the tiny detail. And to be honest, I really like the, the monochrome of this. I do love color. Don't get me wrong. I mean, duh, check the nails. But I, and in my planners, I also love color. But um, these specific illustrations, I think, are just beautiful as is. I would, I will be coloring or putting in stickers and washi and things like that um, in the planner itself. So we go straight into January. A lovely illustration again. Important dates. And to the page. And then you put your things to do. So it's important things to do. Goals, your action plan for the month. Positive mind and good vibes. So here you could put in a scripture verse. You could put in your word of the month. Your word of the year. You could put in an affirmation. You could put in a positive or motivational quote that you really enjoy. So you could really put anything in here. It's, and it's a nice thing to have. And then you've got some note pages. Uh, I think there's, yeah, there's two note pages. Uh, here's a lovely quote. It's not what you are that holds you back. It's what you think you are not. And that is very, very true. And then you go into your weekly planner. So your weekly planner has Monday to Sunday in these um, rectangle blocks going horizontally. So here you could put your appointments. Um, and then you have note pages. Um, and that's basically the planner. Um, I'm going to flip through it <laughs> because it is too cute. It's too cute not to flip through. 
But um, so what you would do, like if I was going to use this as a planner, and I say if I was going to use this as a planner, and I'll tell you why in just a moment, um, I'll say that, but uh, because I'm going to use it for something else. But what I would do is I would then put my appointments here. So my schedule would go here, and then I would make these daily pages. Uh, because you do get quite a few, and you've got your headers, you can put your dates in, and you've got some lovely quotes. And... So this, for me, would be sort of semi-bullet journal setup. Um, so you don't have all of the um, uh, components of the bullet journal, but you do have some of it. And I think for someone like myself, who is not, I'm not an artistic bullet journaler, bullet journaler. Um, I have the utmost respect for artistic bullet journalists. I think they, they, I just can't do it. I just don't have the, A, the patience or B, the talent to do what they do. So to have something like this that's kind of set up for you is, is a joy. It's an absolute joy. So at the end of every week, you get your end of week check-in. And I'm going to have, I was actually going to start doing this anyway, um, which I got from Marianne from uh, the Blow Malfa, my Blow Malfa key. Um, Marianne Hammersais. Um, her channel, if you guys have not checked out her channel, I'm going to link it below. She is Next Level Functional Planning. And let me tell you, I have learned so much from her. And she is South African and us South African girls have got to stick together. So, and she's she's amazing. She's absolutely amazing. She and I've gotten to know each other over Zoom. She's based in Cape Town. And, and I just adore her. I really do. Um, I've learned so much from her in the short while that we've been friends. And I can call her friend um, with confidence. And um, she's amazing. She really is amazing. So I highly, highly recommend if you check out any channel on YouTube, apart from mine, of course, <laughs> um, check out Marianne's because um, you, you will learn a lot. You will learn if you are interested in actual productivity, productivity and functionality and, and that sort of thing, you definitely need to have a look. So I'll, I'll have her linked in the description box. So end of the week check-in, she does every week. And this is where you go over your week and you just sort of say to yourself, you ask the questions like, what worked? What didn't work? What did I not get to and why? What did I get to and celebrate that win? What worked? I said that already. But you know what I'm saying. So you basically would sort of, it's almost like a um, a review of your week. Yeah, it's a check-in. It's a, weekend, a weekly check-in. It's a good thing. It's a good thing to do. Then you go straight into your next week and you have your weekly planner. And then you have your daily pages again what i have to tell you is that i've flipped through this planner because it is a lot of planner this is a lot of pages i haven't seen any repetition i haven't yes banners yes i'm talking about quotes i haven't seen the quotes repeated um so just flipping through it i mean you can see just how gorgeous it is how much space you get to write um, so let me tell you what I'm going to use this for. I'm actually going to use this as my Bible study, Bible journal, um, not my prayer journal. I have a separate prayer journal and um, I'm, I must actually do an updated video of that, um, which I use my Coffee and Bible Time Girls prayer journal um, on sticky notes, uh, with sticky notes for my prayer journal. So this is going to be my Bible study my Bible journaling, as in my quiet time reflection and sermon notes and the um, word of the day. So scripture writing. Um, and that's what I'm going to use this for because I just felt it's too pretty for me to use as a planner. <laughs> um, and I have my bullet journal. Um, as you know, I'm in my B6 uh, Stylogy at the moment. And I'm waiting for my cover from Lonky uh, from Props to Dots. I'll link her below as well. She does the most amazing covers. You've seen my videos. Um, you've seen um, her on social. You must have seen her on social media. If you haven't, please check her out. She is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Her, her TNs are fantastic. Just exquisite and i use that word very uh seriously with her. her her stuff is exquisite um so i just you know i don't have need for a planner planner because i have my bullet journal i'm also using my um uh map for life 
um, as my weekly and I'm going to be doing my and, and my goal setting planner so I'm going to be doing my um, planner lineup for 2021 video very soon very very soon um, I'm just waiting for a couple of things and then I'm going to do my lineup um, <laughs> and it is a lineup <laughs> and um, so uh, it's going to have a, a very good mix of bullet journal. It's going to have this beautiful planner spiral bound. It's going to have um, disc bound happy planner style, not happy planner itself, but I'm using disc bound um, style. It's going to have uh, A5 rings. Um, so it's got a bit of everything. And I didn't actually plan it that way. It's just turned out that way. So just keep an eye up for that one. It's coming in the next few days. Um, so what I'm going to do, yeah, so that's what I'm going to use it for. I'm using it, I'm going to use it as Bible study, um, Bible, uh, my, you know, being in the word reflection, sermon notes, word of the day. So my weekly, the weekly itself, I will use for, to write the scripture. I can write very small. I have a Hobonichi pen, which was gifted by my good friend, Nomsa Romano. Um, her channel is also a wonderful channel on YouTube if you're into Bible journaling if you're into um, scripture writing that sort of thing I shall link her below as well I hope I remember to do all this um, and because you know I don't plan these videos I just wing them I just I just go with it so I don't have a list of people that I want to mention I just as as it comes up um, but I write more she gifted me her Hobonichi pen and let me tell you something and I'm, I'm just I have to show you this pen and I know that in Japan this would probably be probably be as common as a big pen I mean let's face it it looks exactly the same but let me tell you something this pen writes like a dream like a dream Marianne you were right it, it writes like a dream it is fine 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 point it is gel yet not gel it is ballpoint yet not ballpoint if that makes sense it it writes it just it's just and I can do the tiniest tiniest writing and little doodles and things like that and it just writes beautifully um and i absolutely love it so thank you norms for that um she wasn't a fan and when she said that she had it and i was like oh my gosh really and she said yes i can have it and i was like oh my gosh thank you so much i was so happy i was really happy and and stationary lovers everywhere you will understand my joy over a pen my husband does not understand but i you will understand you will understand okay so where were we that was it so that's it basically so that's your planner it's beautiful I love it I can't wait for January to start let me just close it um, please be impressed that I the first thing I did is I didn't cut off the wire bounder and stick it on discs like I do with every other planner and um, that comes on on a spiral um i decided to keep it as is i decided to just keep it as it is i think it's perfect the way it is i love it so that is it my lamika design and illustration journal planner and i will see you in the next video bye <laughs>